Welcome to Clemson University. My name is John Traurig and I'm from Atlanta, Georgia. I'm studying marketing and finance here at Clemson and I'm also a tour guide on campus. Today, I'll be showing you around with some of our fellow other tour guides. Right now, I'm standing outside of the visitor center, which sees an average of 70,000 annual visitors. Hey guys, my name is William Bosley and I'm a marketing major from Aiken, South Carolina. Right behind me, you guys will see the Robert Muldrow Cooper Library and that's gonna be the center point of our campus. Clemson is set up like a target, and think of that Cooper Library as the bullseye. The first ring outside of that is going to be our academic spaces. The second ring is going to be student life, such as residence halls and dining halls. And then that third ring is going to be reserved for our athletic facilities as well as our parking lots. I'm currently standing under the Watt Family Innovation Center, which is home to Clemson's Creative Inquiry Programs, which is essentially student-led research. We are a tier one research institution here at Clemson, which means you can get involved as beginning as your freshman year all the way up to your senior spring. It is great hands-on experience and you get to actually look at the things you're learning in the classroom in real life. Over just behind me is the Academic Success Center and that's exactly what it is. It's a great spot for our students to get a little bit extra help in each of their courses with our different offerings such as the PAL program which stands for Peer Assisted Learning where our students who have made an A in that course are retaking it alongside you. They're sitting in all of your lectures, all of your classrooms and they'll develop study sessions for you two to three times a week outside of that classroom. We also have drop-in tutoring for every single course that's housed within the Academic Success Center, as well as different workshops and materials that you can constantly go to if you need any additional help. Hey y'all, my name is Kendall Gedeke and I am a marketing major from St. Louis, Missouri. Right now I'm standing outside of the Hendricks Student Center, which is one of our main areas for student life on campus. One of the most important features of Hendricks is that it is home to a lot of great study spaces and meeting spaces for all of our clubs and organizations here on campus. Here at Clemson, we have over 550 clubs and organizations for you to get involved in during your time as a student. One of my biggest pieces of advice for anyone who's a freshman at Clemson is to find something to get involved in during your first year. Whether that's student government, Greek life, the Chocolate Milk Club, we really have anything and everything that you could be interested in during your time here. Getting involved will really make the campus feel a lot smaller and help you find a great community of people from the start. Another important thing about Hendrix is the third floor, which is home to our Career Service Center. It is consistently one of the top ranked career service centers in the country, and it has a lot of great resources for our students to utilize during their time at Clemson. That includes resume workshops, mock interviews, really anything that you could need to help get you that internship or the job that you really want after graduation or during your time here at Clemson. And one of the most important things about that center is that it's available to you up to a year after you graduate. So if for some reason you aren't happy with where you've chosen to go after you graduate from Clemson, you're always able to come back here and they can help you find a better fit. Hey y'all, I'm Erica Waring and I'm an agricultural education major from Seneca, South Carolina. Right now we're in our middle ring of campus that has residence halls and dining halls. Behind me is the east side of campus that has low rises and high rises, and these are community style options. In community style options, you're gonna share a room with one other person, and you're gonna have a hall style restroom clean for you each and every day. Now on the other side of campus, on the west side, we also have community style options, but there's also the suite style options, which is where you share a room with one other person, and your room and one other room will have a bathroom in the middle. So that's four people sharing one restroom. You definitely want to hop on to the Clemson University housing and dining website so you can learn more about all of our options because here at Clemson you have the option to choose exactly where you want to live. Now that priority is decided based upon when you apply to the university. So you want to get your ap application in as early as possible so you get the time ticket to, to choose where you want to live. Now no matter where you decide to live on campus, all of our buildings have AC, free laundry service, and you're going to have one to two RAs on your floor. Now one last thing to consider when it comes to where you want to live is who you're going to room with. So you have three options to choose your roommate. First off, you can room with someone you're friends with, someone you already know. Secondly, you can join a social media, Facebook page, or group of accepted students to find someone. And lastly, you can do the random roommate generator where you answer a questionnaire with information about you and it will match you up with someone who's gonna be most compatible to share a room with. Now we also have LLCs here on campus. LLCs are living learning communities. Our biggest one is RISE, which is Residence in Science and Engineering. And um, we also have smaller ones like Connections, which I was a member of my freshman year, and that's Minority Student LLC. You can also get information about our 20 different LLCs on the Clemson University Housing and Dining Portal. For transportation, all students are allowed to bring a car here on campus. There's an annual fee associated with that, and you're gonna park based upon where you live. 
but do not feel like you have to have a car here on campus. It's definitely easiest just to walk to your classes each day. Um, we also have the Tiger Transit system and the CAT bus system for those of you who don't have a car here in Clemson. They can take you around the Clemson surrounding area as well as across campus both night and day. Last but not least, if you're an out-of-state student and you don't have a car but you need to get back and forth to the airport, we have free airport shuttles around all of our major breaks that can take you to the Greenville Airport or the Charlotte Airport free of charge. For safety, we are consistently ranked one of the safest campuses in the nation each year, so you can rest assured you're going to be taken care of here at Clemson University. Right now we're standing outside of Douthat Hills, which is one of our newest areas for student living on campus. In Douthat, there's a building called The Hub, which is home to our bookstore, a rec center, and one of our three main dining halls on campus. As a freshman, you're required to have an unlimited meal plan at Clemson, which gives you as many swipes as you want into all of our three main dining halls on campus. In addition to your meal swipes, you'll be able to choose an amount of paw points that you have on your card as well. Paw points are basically a dollar to dollar equivalent, so one paw point is one dollar, and you're able to use those at any of our retail dining locations that we have on campus, like our Chick-fil-A, our Witch Witch, a Starbucks, really anything you want. So between your meal swipes and your paw points, you have access to lots of different options for dining on campus. I'm currently standing on Bowman Field, which is Clemson's front lawn. When students get out of their classes, you can see a lot of them come out here and play spike ball, throw football, and throw baseball. Additionally, You'll see students come out here on Bowman Field and study as Clemson is surrounded in a Wi-Fi bubble. So anywhere you are on campus, you'll have access to the Wi-Fi. Therefore, you don't just have to go study in our library or any of our academic buildings. You can literally study anywhere that you want to on our campus. Some really cool events that take place right here on Bowman Field are going to include ESPN's College Game Day, as well as our homecoming activities. Our various organizations around campus will build homecoming floats throughout our whole homecoming week as well as build a house for Habitat for Humanity. Located directly across from Bowman Field is going to be home to our small but mighty downtown. Clemson has great town gown relations. You can always go grab a nice bite to eat downtown as well as go into our, our many shops and get any Clemson apparel. Here we are at the North Green on campus. Right behind me you can see our Cooper Library, our outdoor amphitheater as well as our reflection pond. We're right in the heart of campus inside that first ring of all academic buildings. Here at Clemson we have around 19,500 undergraduate students, but it certainly feels smaller than that with our average class size of around 30 to 32, our median class size of around 19, as well as our student to faculty ratio of 16 to 1. One of the things that I love about Clemson is that smaller class size where I get a really personalized education and attention from my professors within all of the resources that come with being at a huge school like Clemson. Right now we're on the west side of campus and I'm standing outside of the Union, the Greek Quad, and Core Campus. The Greek Quad is home to our Greek life here on campus and about 25% of our students are involved in different clubs and organizations within that. Core Campus is going to be home to some housing, some dining, and also our Honors College, which does have a separate application from the normal Clemson application. I'm sitting on the sun deck of our Fike Recreation Center. Here at Clemson we have two main recreation centers on campus. House inside of Fike are going to be all the treadmills, ellipticals, free weights you could ever imagine, all available for our students to use. Additionally, we're going to have a steam room, a sauna, a pool, a high dive area, racquetball courts, and basketball courts. Here at Clemson, another great way to get involved is with intramural sports and club sports. Intramural sports is going to be a little less competitive, but it's a great way to have some fun with your friends or any organization that you're involved here on campus. Club sports is going to be a little more competitive and you're actually going to have to try out to make those teams. We have over 33 club sports that you can try out and participate in here at Clemson University. Behind me is one of my favorite spots on campus, Memorial Stadium, aka Death Valley. That's going to be home to our Clemson football team and where you and 80,000 of your best friends are going to pack in on those Saturdays that the Tigers play here in Clemson. Other than football, we have 18 other varsity sports and no matter the game day, it's a great day to support our Clemson family. We're consistently ranked top five for the amount of students who pack our stadiums no matter the sport because here at Clemson, we're all one family. To close out our tour, we are in Trusty Park, which is just a short walk from the heart of campus, Cooper Library. Cooper Library has six floors full of resources to help you succeed as a student. One of those resources is the Adobe Digital Studio. Every student on campus has free access to the Adobe Creative Cloud, and there's someone in that studio who can help teach you how to use those resources to help you become more proficient. The library also has so many great study atmospheres to help you be successful, whether you want a quiet space by yourself or a group table to get those group projects done. 
Here at Clemson, I've enjoyed my time so much because of the Clemson family. When we say that we're a family, it means that you know that your professors, your fellow students, everyone is cared for and loved here on campus and everyone's rooting for you to be successful. Thank you so much for watching with us today and we can't wait to see you on campus. On behalf of the entire Clemson family, go Tigers!